Oh, hold up, hold up, hold up. Did I just get a badass looking helmet? <laughs> oh, I did. Oh, I did. All right. Oh, dude, I love that helmet. That looks so awesome. What about gloves? What I got for gloves? Anything new? No. <coughs> I love this helmet. We shouldn't delay here any further. Even rats like these have friends on Kefalonia. By Zeus, these Kefalonian <coughs> bandits. This used are to be a nice open. village. Good thing but you're now it's just side. a nest of anarchy and crime. Oh, that's messed up. I can't thank you enough. After spending most of my life at sea, it would have been absolutely shameful to drown in a pot. Ah, where are my manners? I am Varnavas, captain of the Andrestia. Well, Varnavas, I'm pleased to meet you. I'm Cassandra, Mistios by trade. <laughs> oh, but you're much more than that, I'm sure. What do you mean? When they forced my head underwater, I prayed to the gods. And when they pulled it out, <laughs> there you were. <sighs> All of Kefalonia heard your prayers. I just happened to be closest. <laughs> and you just happened to fight like Achilles while <laughs> Zeus's eagle flies around your head. I love this game. Where do you come from? Everywhere, nowhere. The Adrestia is my home. But I was born in an olive grove in Mykonos. I haven't stepped foot there since I left for the military. So, you're a soldier? I was. My brothers and I were captains in the Athenian fleet. Until one night during a siege, Poseidon's fury destroyed our ships. That was the night I saw it. It? What did you see? The Kraken. The sea god commands more than just the winds and the waves when he truly unleashes his temper. I saw his beast, his murderous pet. Few believe me, but this dead eye is a permanent reminder. Punishment for looking on Poseidon's forbidden creature and living to tell the tale. So, you have a ship? Of course. Gods forbid I'd end up stuck in this place. What is it now? Thanks to you, it's still in Sami Harbor, where I left it. Perhaps the fates brought us together after all. I'm in need of a ship and a crew. <laughs> you save my life. It would disgust the gods to not offer it in return. So that's a yes? My ship, my crew, and my services are yours. You truly aren't from around here. <laughs> gods, no. And I thank them for that. Come now and see the Adrestia. Nico. Up. All right, cool. Why is it way over there? Ella. No, I'll go that way. Ella. Let's go.
There it is. I'm pretty sure that's the boat he was talking about. When you are, Captain. Wait! Wait for me, Cassandra. I'm all packed and everything. You're coming, are you? If you're going, I'm going. Damn. Kefalonia is the only place you've ever known. You'd leave your home? I would if it meant staying with you. Can't go where I'm going. I need to be alone. Who's going to keep you company? I'll be fine. If I can't come, then take Hara. Hara? My pet eagle. She's my friend. Mater gave her to me. But she'll be your friend now. And it'll be like I'm there with you. You know, to remind you of me. Thanks, Phoebe. Besides, I love Kina to play with, since you saved her. Go easy on her. She may still be shaky with the fever. But you have to promise we'll see each other again. Aww, why would you say that? I promise. You haven't seen the last of me. Just stay out of trouble until then. I will. Don't worry. Okay, you can leave now. Cassandra! Leaving Kefalonia without saying goodbye to your dear Marcos? Tell me it isn't true. Well, you're here now, so it won't be true. Goodbye, Marcos. All these years as a dynamic duo! I'll never replace you! Well, I may need another assistant someday, but it won't be easy. Come now, give me a hug. All right, come here. Yes, bring it in. Oh, will I ever miss you, Cassandra? Thanks, Marcos. I'll miss you too. And what does the future hold for you? Wine, of course. Though you never know when the vines will wither. I'm always ready for another adventure. Speaking of adventure, I have a task for you, dear Phoebe. An adventure? Yes! Already following in your footsteps, isn't she, my friend? Ready to set sail? This is kind of sad. <laughs> Prepare to cast off. It's time to leave. Good. The tides wait for neither man nor woman. Time to go. So, what course do we set? Where in this big, beautiful world does the mighty Cassandra want to go? Megaris. <laughs> Megaris? But we'll be sailing into war. I got a contract for some general's head. Whose head? They call him the Wolf. The Wolf? Who wants Nikolaos of Sparta dead? Nikolaos of Sparta? Uh-oh, flashback. The Oracle has spoken! <laughs> to prevent Sparta's fall, the child must fall first. You can't let this happen! Please, he'll do no harm. He'll help us. He will lead us! Silence! <laughs> So messed up.
God's honor, for the life she has not. Look she is me, not Spartan, Nicholas. Don't. don't listen, Nicholas. Don't listen. No. No. Don't listen, Nicholas. Just Spartan kicks her off. Get me to Megaris. Now. But I don't understand. Of all the places under Ilios, why risk our necks to go there? The wolf of Sparta is my father. Oh, shit. So it looks like we're not gonna be a Spartan then, after all, if we're going against them. It finally took- it took him this long for the intro? Bruh. Okay, it, it's pretty awesome, and I love it, but holy shit, that took a long time for an intro. <laughs> Nothing like a sea breeze. Does the deck always feel like it's moving? <laughs> I've got the perfect opportunity for you to get your sea legs. Oh? What would that be? Well, when the Cyclops was giving me a drumming, his pirates took my cargo. I know their ship, and I know where they're heading. What say we get it back? Sure. It'll be a good opportunity to see how your ship and crew perform. All right there. Let's get moving. Oh, this is so awesome. Let's see how the sails have held up. I love this game. Oh, I love it. Alright guys, I'm actually gonna end it here. Um, I'll probably pick it up later in the night. So guys, yeah. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.